Hey, hello everyone, welcome to Dragon Gaming's Friendly Realm with your host for today's episode of Dragon Gaming Here for Gaming. Today, we're going to continue in the campground like we were in the past couple of episodes. And today, we're going to come back to the today's chest of materials because we actually now have stuff in for this episode. So, we currently have some uh, wool. Because one note was supposed to be more purple wool, but that is okay. Uh, next uh, couple of episodes, when we get the uh, campground finished, we're going to add some more house improvements and, of course, a little kind of a, a guild holly type thing on the mountain. I think that's a really, really nice touch that we can add. But today, before we start working on the campground, let's add somebody to the campfire ring. I really need to get in the habit of saying invite. But today, we're adding Jack Septicai for being an all-out amazing person. There are There is one rule to the campfire ring, and that is that you cannot ask. And that... Everything is practically free reign. So, I am going to go and, uh, I'm going to leave the dogs at the house today. I'm, a, I'm going to forget they're out here, and B, fire. Yeah, and that's a smartest thing in the world. So, this entire area here is dedicated to the campground. But we're going to focus our main thing right now on just kind of like this little tiny area and of course we can always add more to it if we feel it's necessary but right now we are going to be adding a couple of camper vans now I'm gonna add a, a more of an amphitheater right down here not only does it kind of look like one but that was kind of the original intention, so we're going to steer clear from that. Especially in these first couple of episodes. There is a doggy. Alright. Let's get a relative flat piece of ground. That we can put a camp for van on. So, I'm going to clear, clear this up for those that don't know. But... Everything on the end right over there is going to be a town, minus the one we've got uh, over here. We're going to add, I think we're going to add a camper van right here. We're going to add a camper van right here. Because I feel like it's a little bit of a, it's not going to be that big of a stretch to uh, add one here. And the cool thing about adding camper vans, besides the fact I get to choose where I put my camper vans, is I kind of get to decide what they look like. But we're really going to kind of focus a little bit on just little tiny campsites and all of that for the first couple of episodes. I'm going to uh, lower this. So I noticed that's a big problem I didn't even think about. Uh, excuse me, Dougie. I always get scared doing that around dogs. Particularly wolves, because those are uh, neutral mobs. Not only does that look a little bit better, it actually gives us a little bit of work room for... I knew that was going to happen! Hey! 
Hey, anyone else? Okay. I didn't mean to, dog. Alright, let's put the camper van again. Before I lose track. Ugh. I'm so glad that dog didn't even notice me. Okay. So we're going to add one here. We're going to So the way I'm going to do these camper vans is that at some point I do kind of want to walk inside them. But I think what I'm probably going to do, especially for early camper vans, to give kind of a, uh, a less... Let's see what I'm looking for here. More in, less invasive type of deal. We're just going to kind of stick to the normal camper van. Oh, yeah, I know. There are some other ways to build little camper vans in Minecraft now, but this is just what we're going to deal with. And I am going to, yeah, that looks about right. I'll be honest, I haven't really tried building stuff like this. <laughs> I'm honest with you. So... The fact that I don't know what I'm doing isn't, uh, if that's not obvious, I don't know what is, because at this point, like, it's pretty obvious I have almost zero clue how to build camper vans. Yes, I probably should have done some research on what camper vans look like. Yes, I probably should have practiced building camper vans. But none of that is of any importance right now. Yeah, we're just gonna make these, uh, little wool camper vans. Uh, the purpose of a camper van is just to uh, go from point A to point B. I ain't really to quick fashion roll. I also would like to point out I am not an ar architect. I can kind of walk inside this. It's not as spacious as I was hoping, but you know what? That's, that's perfectly fine. Not, not many cars are that spacious. And what we're going to do with these camper vans is not only are they going to add scenery where we heavily need it, scenery and such, they're just they're kind of going to add more to it. I did say that we are, this is like a little campground area, so the best thing about this is that it's practically going to act like a real, you know, kind of like a real campground. We're going to have, we're going to have people all over the uh, campground. That's perfectly fine uh, by me. So what, what we're doing, whoa, I did not mean to activate that. Yeah, so basically what we're going to do is we're going to build tiny little, uh, see, like, this would be, like, where you would enter your camper van. Just like that. I can kind of do a little bit like that. I don't need this. I'm going to need this more. You know, I completely underestimated how much wool it was going to take to build a camper van. <laughs> it's okay, we... We have a couple of episodes to work on camper vanning. If that's the term for it. I'm keeping the uh, rear window. Not only does it, well, not only will it look a little nicer, but uh, someone's got to look out that rear view win window. Yeah. This is. 
I'm trying to make sure that was clear. Alright. They actually don't look too terrible for camper van. I am. I'm going to call it a night, though, and head straight to your bed. I think I said I'm probably am going to work on this in between it. I ain't mentioned it this episode, but uh, out of episode, I think I'm going to work on it out of episode and kind of get the foundation started for the little guild hall and such. But I think that's a really, pretty good start for uh, today's episode. It's, it's not the most perfect thing in the world, but it definitely could be worse. The main problem I'm going to worry about for this episode, especially in this one in particular, is lately the uh, recorder only wants to record up to like 13 minutes or so. So I'm trying to be as quick as I possibly can for this episode. And it sucks because I, I was uh, doing dying, dying in the entire episode so far. Like I said, not an architect. This is like our little, uh, our little camper van. Like I said, could have been done better. But, uh, I'm honestly not going to complain. I probably shouldn't complain, because it's my own thing, but... I will point out, I do usually... Usually happen to uh, do things so much better. All right. So we're going to light that up. Light this up. I don't want anything spawning back there. And I can make these, uh, these look like little lights back here. Obviously, in due time, I'm going to actually add some real lights. That was more like a truck than anything. Well, like I said, I'm eventually going to add actual lights. That 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 doesn't look too terrible for first episode. Like I said, could be done better. And maybe over time, we actually will update specific parts of the campground. But right now, the reason I'm for up expanding it now, instead of waiting till later, like I usually do, is uh, this little spot is not going to be able to hold for long. And I don't really have the spot like I did in the last world, but I can just kind of make an amphitheater. Which, by the way, is what the uh, amphitheater bit down here is supposed to represent. Yeah, we're going to build a tiny little amphitheater right there. And all it really is going to be is just a bunch of seats. And maybe we'll build like a tiny little stage or something. I'll have to plan this out, see what I think, but... um. Yeah, I'm going to end the episode here for right now, so I still have time to upload it for the days over. As you probably don't know, I upload, I record these the day I'm supposed to upload them. And sometimes I will procrastinate until the very last moment like I did today. But um, I'm going to try getting into a habit of recording them days ahead. But that, that's where I'm going to end this episode. So today, we, next episode, we're going to finish up some parts right there. We're gonna add stuff like amphitheater. We're gonna add oh, maybe a one more or two or more camper vans. We're going to add tiny little campfires. We're going to add a lot more. You know, some of that I'll do out of episode. Uh, I think some more camper vans I'll do out of episode. And then next episode, while we're at it, 
I'm also going to uh, build kind of the outline of the guild hall and start working on house renovations so that way it's not just this every episode. We can start something new, maybe on a balcony or something. But like I said, that is going to be the end of today's episode. I hope you guys did enjoy it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.